And that's why I like Deathclaw Hentai. Hey, what are you doing here? Get fucked, liberal. Residents of Diamond City, wake up. The woke media over at Public Occurrences is spreading lies and deceit that push the liberal agenda. Piper Wright has written a series of articles accusing Mayor McDonough of being a synth. Now listen here, Piper, just because our great mayor can't send all of our security out into the Commonwealth to find some random vault dweller's baby doesn't mean he's a synth. Also, Diamond City security is in no need of reform as the boys in baseball uniforms do their very best to keep the Raiders and Super Mutants out. Speaking of Mayor McDonough, his policy of keeping ghouls out of Diamond City is completely justified. Tell me why ghouls make up 10% of the population, commit half the crimes. He's going to ban all ghouls and keep a wall in between us and them. However, despite these policies, the left will let anyone into the city these days as Nick Valentine, a synth, has been allowed to live in our city for quite some time now. Now let me be clear, just because he saved the mayor's daughter once, it doesn't mean he's not a ticking time bomb ready to explode. People may think these synths deserve rights, but facts don't care about your feelings. Synths are not people. What's next we're giving rights to our toasters? Not only that, but I saw the sole survivor walk into Diamond City with a super mutant. Like these Minutemen types have no regard for rules and regulations. Speaking of rules and regulations, you know which town has none? Good neighbor. That woke Hancock doesn't deserve to wear the clothes of this country's founding fathers when he's nothing but a pathetic junkie. He just lets anyone into his already overpopulated town and just lets them do whatever they want without consequence. I just wish the Brotherhood of Steel would just fly in and wipe them all out. Speaking of the, the Brotherhood, they continue to defend us from all the dangers of the wasteland and all they ask in return is some crops from our local farmers here in the Commonwealth. But of course, the lazy settlements who are run by the liberal Minutemen, I might add, don't want to feed our brave soldiers, and so the Brotherhood have resorted to more assertive measures. Which they should. In fact, all of the problems in this wasteland is due to these woke Minutemen who think they are still relevant after all these years. My sources tell me that the general of the Minutemen has been inside the Institute and refuses to share any details with the Brotherhood. Could the sole survivor be working with the Institute while posing as some sort of hero of the people? You tell me, folks. Speaking of You've the got to left, be kidding me. The Railroad have been attacking Brotherhood outposts, yelling, Synth lives matter, and yet they get mad when intellectuals like myself say, Human lives matter. Hey, what the fuck are you doing in here? You libtard. <laughs> 